Hi, this is Dr. Linda Davis, and today I want to discuss the Excel function called count A. Uh, the count A function has value from the standpoint that it can just count actual text items that might be in a range of cells, and you just want to have that uh, those text items counted up to reveal how many spots they're taken up. So what we have here is a simple roll call example. We have a column called student name, which is random student names here. And let me just show you how at the bottom of this we have 11 showing here. That means there's 11 student names in this particular range that we've named. Um, let me reveal the formula. We, the way you write a count A function is that it's equals and then count A. So it's count A um, just lets Excel know that it's just for counting text kind of items. And we have parentheses, B7, colon, or into B17. So the range of cells is B7 to B17, uh, starting with, let me go back up a little bit here, B7 is where our first student name appears, and the range goes all the way down to B17, and so that's why it gave us an answer of 11 names. Now, let me just delete that and just type it in again just for practice sake. So we have equals, and then we type in count A, and then you're going to start with your parentheses, put in the range of cells you want it to examine, and we set our range of cells, obviously very short range of cells just for demonstration purposes, but you can see if you had, you know, 1,050 names and you needed to know it was 1,050 names on here, you could put that uh, range in it, it would automatically calculate that for you. So let me finish this out. Our range today is B7 to B17. Finish it off with your parentheses, of course, for your range of cells, and then hit enter, and that's how it gives counts it up and says, okay, you've got 11 names taking up space in 11 different cells. Okay, so I hope this uh, formula helps you in whatever way you manage to apply it. Thank you for your time.